Thank you, Stan. And I uh, want to thank everybody in your office for putting on Media Day. Thank all the media for coming. Appreciate y'all being here. And it's, it's nice to be down on this uh, beautiful campus in this beautiful city and welcome Incarnate Word. Uh, we've already welcomed them because we got to play them. And uh, everybody's happy to have you in now, Coach Santiago, but wait till they play you. I don't know if they're going to be that happy because he's got a tough ball club. And uh, they're, they're an excellent football team, and I'm sure they're going to do well in the LSC. Uh, the Greyhounds, we're very excited about what's going on with the Greyhounds. Uh, uh, we have about 16 or 17 starters returning. We've got an older team now for the first time in a long time uh, that I've got to stand up here and say that we're older. Uh, I think we have uh, seven seniors on defense that are returning starters and six seniors on offense that are returning as starters. Uh, almost our entire uh, offense is back. I think we're only one or two players from last year have left. Uh, and uh, two players on defense have, have left. So we, we do have experience and we've got some talent too. Uh, on the offensive side, we've got a good core of receivers led by Jesse Poku, uh, who's an who's a outstanding uh, outside receiver. We have Arvin Jackson and Darian Dale on the inside. Our offensive line is uh, four out of the five are seniors. And uh, our quarterback's a winner. Wes Wood, who was a 2A player of the year in the state of Texas, uh, and he also took uh, his high school to the 2A state championship. And uh, he had a great spring, and we're looking for big things out of Wes. We're really happy to have Wes uh, leading the team on defense. Uh, we've got a preseason All-American at corner, Rodney Mitchell. We have a middle linebacker who led the entire conference in tackles with 132, and Nathan Ulin. Um, and we have uh, quite a bit of senior leadership on, uh, on that side of the ball as well. Um, we're very excited about what's going on here at Eastern. Last year, we led the nation in pass offense. We had a very uh, prolific pass offense, and we're looking to develop our run game a little more. Uh, we run a fast-paced offense. It's pretty wide open. Uh, you know at Eastern, we can't just do anything in the middle. We either have to run it 90 times or, or pass it 90 times. We, we, we're not very much for sitting in the middle, but uh, uh, we're going to try and run the ball a little bit more. We have sophomores at running back. If one of those, if one of those young men emerges, I think we could be really, really tough on offense and, and defensively. Uh, we've got some people that can can play in that secondary, and some people up front. I think can put some heat on. We're very excited about what's going on at Eastern. Uh, two players that joined me today are two local players that are that are going to be freshmen. We thought we'd have them in. Very excited about the these two young men and their future. Uh, Tyler Winkas from Shirts. Texas Clements High School, he's a defensive end, and Greg Scott is a wide receiver from Stevens High School right here in San Antonio. And uh, we've got a few San Antonio boys on the squad, and we're happy to have those two here with us today and, and uh, look forward to a bright future for them. Uh, we're, we're really excited about being in the North. You know, we've had some great, great football games with some of those North teams. Uh, I've been at Eastern for 14 years in different capacities leading up to the head coach and some of the greatest games that I can remember were some teams, uh, some games that we had versus North opponents. Uh, 1998, a game that comes to my memory was in 1998 we went to Northeast Oklahoma and uh, they were fifth in the nation, we were ninth in the nation. That's one of the greatest games that I've ever been in. Uh, we've had great games with Southeast, we've had some incredible games with Central Oklahoma. Uh, everybody in the league, Southwest, East Central, uh, so we, we were delighted to uh, be in that division. We still have the opportunity to play some great teams from the, north, uh, from the south that we're very excited about that too. So uh, th there's some good things going on at Eastern. We've got our offense rolling. If we get our defense up to where, uh, we, think it need, uh, where we think it should be, uh, we think we could be a pretty formidable opponent. There's some really, really good football coaches in this room, and there's some really good football players in this room. And uh, we're proud to be a part of the LSC. And uh, we're going to do our best to uh, bring that North Division title home to Portales. Alice.